Hi, welcome back to the show. When Hawaii gets hot in the summer, we like to go looking for a cool time in Alaska. And you know, few things are cooler than this. Taking a plane ride to go fishing. So, let's go find ourselves a pilot. Scott Van Valen, how you doing? Hey, good. Thank you for having us as guests here. It's beautiful, this place. You bet. I understand Hawaii ties. You've got a lot of them. Yep. Um, I, I've been living there for 20 years and just winters only and uh, went to Parker School mm -hmm. on the Big Island. And my wife, uh, Nani's from Honolulu, who also, her family had uh, a lodge in Alaska as well. The average visitor, El Capitan, how many nights, how many days? Uh, average, the average trip here is three nights and three days of fishing. How many people stay at the lodge on, on one of these uh, visits? A uh, full group for us is 20 people per group. Mm -hmm. How big is your staff? Um, our staff size is about 22 this year. That's terrific. When the service outnumbers the guests, you know things are going to go well. Yep, yep. So, Scott, beautiful day to day. What do you have planned for us? We're going to uh, go into a, a special lake that uh, has no road access. That's why we're going to be taking the plane. Not that plane, is it? That plane right there. That small plane. Yeah. You've been flying for more than a week? Um, yep. The landings are a little difficult, and I'm still trying to figure those out, but we'll give it a try. Hey Scott, what's the name of this lake? Have you given it a name? Um, it's this lake's called Carta, and the one we're gonna fish above is called Salmon Lake. Nani's favorite place. Yes, it's the place we go every birthday. Scott, what a pretty place. Yep, it's awesome here. It's peaceful. Yeah. You lose track of time out here, I'm sure. Definitely. Yeah, if you just cast it out yeah. and then just give it quick like strips, they yeah. Anything quick. There we go. Hanapa. These are nice fish, Scott. Yeah, you hit hard too. Oh. <laughs> Woo -hoo, here we go. Yeah, looks like the rainbow bite is on. Scott, what do we got here? This is uh, one of the cutthroat that live in the lake. And there's why they call it cutthroat. All those little red markings makes it look like their exactly. throat is cut, huh? Yep. Got it. How big will they get over here? These, these will get, uh, man, four pounds. There's some in that lake that, that uh, they get really big. Four pounds is huge. Yeah. All right. Nice. He was fun. Yes, he was. There he goes.
Boy, Keith and Kent sure catch on fast. Scott, what you got there? Got a dolly on here. What Great. makes it a dolly? Can you show me that? These dollies have super bright fins on these, orange and with the white, white leading edges, and then uh, real bright orange dots. How big will they get in here? These things will get, uh, man, I'd say you could definitely find five pounders when the smolt's coming out wow. in the spring. Boy, this place has so much action. Good job, man. <laughs> 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 Folks, a lot of people say thank you for this great time out here and the great plane ride, of course, Captain Scott from the El Capitan Lodge, Kent and Keith Nishoka. Folks, don't go away. A lot more of the fishing show is coming your way right after you catch this. <laughs>